everyone, it's Zara and I'm back to film part two of my haul. These are all of the orders that I got yesterday from my mail being on hold, so I'll just go through them all. And so I'm going to start off probably with Pretty on Paper Co, just because it's a really little order. Quick and easy to go through. So I just won, I think I won a $10 shop credit. And so I just tried to keep it pretty minimal. I've been trying to not spend as much money, but I've won a lot of giveaways in December, probably because everyone and their brother was giving away something. And so I've been pretty lucky. And so I just ordered just a couple of things. The first thing I ordered were these little desk stickers. I just thought they were really cute and kind of nice for marking down work or studying. Um, I just thought they were really nice. And then I got one of her, I think these are her horizontal mini kits is what she calls them. And so the boxes are sized to fit the horizontal, but like I've said before, the width is the same as like a vertical box. Um, and so I can use it pretty much in any planner. They're just going to be a little bit shorter. Um, so then you have full boxes, a uh, sidebar box, habit trackers, um, some headers, and then we have just a whole bunch of functional items and checklists, weekend banner, etc. And so it's just a nice little two-page kit. I got this one. This is obviously a Star Wars themed kit, and I think this artwork is really pretty. I've never actually seen all of the Star Wars, you know, gasp. So I thought this would just be kind of a fun one to have, just in case I ever do you know, get around to watching all of them and maybe having a marathon some week. Um, so I thought this would be fun. But that was pretty on Paper Co. I love her shop. I've ordered from her multiple times. And so you should definitely check it out if you've never before. And then the next thing I got was an order from Clarissa Plans It All. I said um, in my last video, I had gotten a sampler from her. Um, but I think she moved to an all digital shop now. And so if you are interested in her stickers, I don't think she does them printed anymore. I think it's all, um, you know, digital or printables or, or whatnot. So I got this order in before she changed. Um, and this one, I also won shop credit to her shop. And so um, I got quite a few things. So for this one, it's just her little uh, freebie. I think this is great. It has a ton of functional stickers. I love like the pink, purple, blue kind of color scheme. I think it'll be perfect for winter. I have a lot of kits that have like this color scheme exactly. Um, so I think that'll be good. And then I have first off these little lazy day um, pillows. And I think I have them somewhere else. I think I might have another color in them. Maybe not. Um, these ones are actually smaller than I thought they would be. I have some that are probably like take up about a half box size. These ones are definitely like would fill up about half of a, like a quarter box. And so they're kind of nice. They're a little bit smaller. And so I will be able to pull them in, um, you know, in different spreads. Then we have just some work font stickers. I just get a lot of use out of these. So I figured I'd order another sheet. And these ones are a lot smaller than other work stickers that I've had. Um, and so, you know, maybe be able to pull them into different spreads or smaller, take up less room with them. Um, then I got her wash car sticker. I figure I don't wash my car super often, but since I have the credit, I figured I'd pick up some stickers um, that are a little bit more unique or things that I don't use all the time, but it'd be nice to have occasionally. Then I got some of her neutral laptops. I thought these would just be nice because I don't have a ton of neutral like stickers in general, but especially not laptops. Then I got her balloon stickers. I got a Hulu binge, which I thought was just kind of fun, uh, just because I do have Hulu and Netflix now, and I have a lot of Netflix binge stickers, um, but not any Hulu binge. Granted, I feel like you could probably use them interchangeably. It's not that big of a deal. Then I have these um, football helmets, another sticker sheet that it's like, I probably won't use them a lot, but I think they're kind of fun to have, you know, like for the Super Bowl or things like that. Um, there's those Lazy Day pillows again, just in the neutral color scheme. Then I got some, oh, what are those, like gas pumps in the colorful color scheme. And then I got some of her car stickers. And I really like these cars. I think they're pretty, 
Um, you know, you can use them in any spread as long as they match, obviously. So that was everything from Clarissa Plans at All. Um, like I said, I highly recommend her shop. I think it was, um, I mean, these were printed stickers, so it's kind of a little bit different, but um, I just thought it was, uh, you know, very good for the printed stickers. I'm sure her printables will be good too. And then I have an order from Lily Henry. To be honest, um, this is probably the last time I'm ordering from Lily Henry. I ordered from her during the PBC sampler squad and it just took forever for her, like her shipping time is kind of long um, anyways. Um, but then she, um, I won uh, like a credit by, by going to the five different shops and um, you know, she just took a really long time to respond and this is the order from using that credit. And so I think the, my first order was in um, like September, by the time I got the credit, it was like November that I was ordering and then, you know, now it's December that I finally get this second order. So anyways, it's just kind of uh, been a long process. And then, um, I don't know, I have, I'll tell you a little bit more when we get to that. Um, so then I got um, the Team Pink sampler. Um, she has like a, a sampler, uh, or not a sampler, um, like a PR team. And so they have different colors that you can mention. Um, this one was Team Pink, which is apparently Kristen. Um, but I just liked her sampler. I thought I would use a lot of these items. Then I got this sheet, which was um, the uh, brunette work sticker. And so it's just kind of cute. She's a brunette just kind of lined up at a laptop. And I just thought this would be good for kind of work and work or studying, things like that, editing, kind of versatile. Then I got a grab bag, um, and one of the things that like kind of annoyed me, like I know with grab bags you kind of take a chance, you could get kind of anything, or you know it could be good, bad, whatever. But I just feel like I really won't use most of these stickers, um, which is kind of you know a bummer. Um, and then also it was supposed to have at least ten sheets in there, and there were only nine. Um, and it's one of those things that it's like I don't really have faith in her. Um, responding to my message. It took her over a month to respond to my message when I had won that shop credit, um, even though I had like posted multiple times, emailed her, messaged her, um, you know, and waiting an appropriate amount of time um, for her to respond. Um, and so uh, I'll probably just, you know, suck it up and just whatever. I, I did purchase these with shop credit, so it's kind of, you know, it is what it is. Um, so the first sheet is probably one of the ones that I will use, um, but it's kind of a weird one. I feel like most people wouldn't use this. It's like um, an injection sticker or um, a syringe sticker. Um, I might be able to use it because I work in the healthcare field, um, but I feel like a lot of people wouldn't really get a use out of it. Um, and a lot of these two are like super old stock, I think. And so um, I guess when I was looking at the grab bag, I thought I would be getting a grab bag with more stuff that was like in her shop. Um, and you know, that is what it is. But then we have these donuts. These ones are just pretty big, so I don't know how often I'll be able to really pull them in. Um, it kind of feels more like a deco sheet than a, like a functional um, sheet. So maybe I'll get some use out of those. I'm not sure. Then we have rainbows. Um, honestly, probably won't get a ton of use out of them, but um, you know, I guess if I see a rainbow, I could use it. Um, these taxi stickers. Um, I actually am planning a trip to New York, but um, even then I probably would only be able to use, you know, a couple of them. Because um, I don't actually know if we'll use the taxi that much, but um, it does make me think of New York, so maybe a little bit. Uh, this one I had, I had to Google it. I had no clue what Roy Gibb is, and so I guess it's like red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. Um, I will never use these. I don't really know what to use them for. Um, then we have this one. It's like a weight loss tracker. Um, I'm assuming because it just says five pounds and it's on a little star. Um, so I know I've seen some people where they have like a jar um, or, you know, some sort of, you know, they'll have a page or something where they mark down their weight loss. Um, you know, I probably won't be using these. I'm trying to go for like a healthier lifestyle versus like focusing on 
any sort of like weight loss if that makes sense like that's great but um, and I don't really have this much weight to lose so um, I won't be using that one um, this one um, is just kind of like a Christmassy word um, so you know you have like ho 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 peace believe love joy Noel. This one's actually really cute, um, and I might hang on to it, but um, I don't think I'll get a, a ton of use out of it just because um, I don't really know how to use this. Um, but it is like kind of Christmassy. I could uh, figure out a use for it, maybe. It's maybe in like a notes page or you know uh, something of, to that effect. And then we have another deco sheet that's like birds. Um, I'll probably end up passing this along to a friend to use, for her to use. Um, and then we have like a, a Hanukkah um, sheet. I don't celebrate Hanukkah, so I'll have to find someone that does and, and just give it to someone else. Um, so like I said, it was kind of a little bit disappointing for a grab bag just because like most of these stickers are not stickers I would really get um, any sort of daily use out of. Um, and like I might be able to kind of figure out some uses for some of them but um all in all like I've had much better grab bags um and then like I said with it only being nine sheets that's kind of just disappointing because it's advertised as a 10 sheet um grab bag and um yeah just kind of whatever but that's probably the last time I'll order from Lily Henry um I think her stickers are great I just think her customer service sucks and um and I know she's talked about like that she's going to make it better but I don't know I just don't have a lot of faith in it. Um, and so, anyways, that was everything from Lily Henry. That was a little bit depressing, so let's move on to like uh, something happier, I guess. So the next shop I have is Hurricane Randy. Um, this one I also won shop credit for. Um, and so this one, I have just a couple of um, things, I guess, to show. So the first thing I have is she was having, I don't remember if I ordered during a sale. I don't really think I did. Um, but this one is was her like monthly planner madness sticker um, maybe I did but since it was um, I was ordering with shop credit I don't know um, I still got this freebie and it's really cute actually I think it's um, like a good buffalo plaid kind of uh, item then I got a couple of neutral stickers I got some neutral glitter headers I like using glitter headers in my TN and so I just thought the neutral would be kind of fun to pick up because I don't have a ton of neutral stickers. Granted, I don't use a lot of neutral kits either, so um, who knows, maybe I won't get as much use out of them as I'm imagining. Um, and then I have this little like half box, quarter box sheet that's also in the neutral color scheme. Then I had one of her, I think this one was just a mini kit format. And so it's her like a marble kit. Um, so you have like a weekend banner, you have all these pretty marbled full boxes, um, Bill do some little icons, a flag, and then we have some bottom washi, some, they're like third box size, um, a sidebar sticker, some little things, and then some more icons and another flag. Um, so this one is just kind of a nice little format. I thought for my TN it would be perfect. Then I have, oh I can't remember what this one was called, but she had a lot of different like Aztec, um, kind of more geometric patterned kits. And so I thought this one was just kind of fun. I really liked the colors. So this one is, I think just her deluxe kit format, I think is what I ordered. So this one has just a bunch of washi. Then we have our full boxes, just very bright and um, geometric. And then we have, I think these are glitter headers and then little things. Then we have her uh, ombre boxes. Then we have sidebar stickers and half boxes, a couple appointment labels, flags, and a weekend banner. Then we have date covers. I think this is more washi, um, sidebar stickers, bill dues, um, icons, and some bigger flags. So that was everything I had from Hurricane Randy. Um, and then I had gotten shop credit um, for her shop. So, it, so that was kind of nice just to be able to get a couple of kits then I have an order from one of my all-time favorite shops. This is from 472 in Maine. I do have a PR code for her shop and down below, I believe it's Zara 20. And so she sent me actually a couple of different things. So um, she sent me a couple of little extras that I'll show right quick. 
Um, one of them was this little pen gems. I have not ordered a pen gems before or like never had a pen gems. Um, and so this was just really pretty. Um, I think this might have been from her Northern Lights collection because I feel like I saw Kate um, show that in one of her Instagram stories. I can't remember if it was her desk tour or like her office tour um, or if it was just she was opening Happy Mail or something. But I feel like I saw her do those and I was like, oh, those are so pretty. Or um, And then when I opened up my package and she had added a couple of extras, I just thought it was really sweet. Um, and then she also included a blue uh, refill. So I'm assuming it comes with like a black, but, uh, and, then a, and then having a blue as well. So I thought that was just super sweet. She also sent me a couple of like a lotion and a hand sanitizer and like a cute little makeup bag. Um, so she was just super duper sweet. So then moving on to my order, uh, the first thing I got was this little freebie. This one actually matches um, another kit that I already have, I'm trying to think of what it's called, um, but it's really cute. It has like polar bears and um, just, it's like pink and blue. Um, so I'll be able to use that with that kit, which I'm hoping to use in January. Then I have this little freebie from um, Gabby's Paper Co. I love this little Taco Tuesday. Um, and then the little time to get crafty. I think those are adorable. And then she has just some other functional stickers. Then I have more little freebies. This one was her planner extravaganza uh, freebie. And then this one, uh, this box says, well, me, I fall in love with you every single day, which is just super cute, perfect for Valentine's Day. I'll probably try to pull it in um, to some sort of a spread, um, especially because with the pink, I feel like I have a ton of kits that have this color scheme and it'll be really easy to incorporate. Then we have my new freebie, um, and then it's birthday themed because my birthday is coming up and I can't wait. So I wanted my freebie to be kind of birthday themed um, and it matches the kit that I'll show in just a minute. Then I picked up a couple of um, add-on sheets. So I picked up the appointment labels that match her birthday kit. Then I have the computers that match her birthday kit. I like these computers because they're just really neutral. Um, you know, just kind of like golds and silvers, um, grays, and then you have this one that has, um, I can't remember, like they're like the paper flowers um, that are in the, the kit. Then I picked up a couple of other appointment labels that match some kits that I already have. Um, and like I said, I've said it before, but I love picking up her appointment labels because um, it's just nice to be able to incorporate them. It really helps to stretch a kit especially if you are um, planning for um, multiple spreads with one kit. Then I got her heart circle icons and her meal circle icons. I just thought I would get a lot of use out of these because they're so uh, versatile um, and especially with the meal icons. Sometimes if I have like a special lunch or breakfast, it's nice to have extras to pull in uh, to a spread. Then I have the birthday kit that I picked up and I did pick up the full birthday kit. Went all out because I'm definitely using this for my birthday. I can't believe that it's only two weeks away. Um, I was looking at my kits and I thought I'm going to do New Year's for the week of January 1st and then I thought I'd have one more week in between my birthday but nope it is the next week is my birthday so um, it's kind of like fun and exciting and crazy fast speaking up on me and um, time really flies. So here's the little freebie, same format as the first one, just with obviously um, this deco instead of the other kits. Then we have this extra little deco page. I love it and I love the little balloons um, because I think that they're really versatile to pull in. Um, this one's really cute as well. It's like a, a I'm trying to think if it's like a ring or if it's like a more of like a balloon arch but I just think it's really cute. Cake pops, presents, confetti, I love it. Then we have this gorgeous kit and so this is the full box sheet. It has um, hugs, kisses, and a lot of birthday wishes and then this one says let them eat cake. Um, I just love it. I think it's really really cute. I love the colors um, and I love the way that she did the full boxes. Then we have the 
oh what is this called like the ombre checklist box and then the mini checklist down at the bottom we have the weekend banner um, some half boxes sidebar stickers um, habit trackers appointment labels and then some other like day off payday and bill due we have a bunch of flags appointment labels we have all of these um, icons and then we have checklists and canceled stickers headers and little things we have the bottom washi and then the washi strips then you have this extra sheet that has well i don't know it's not really an extra sheet maybe it's like an extra sheet um it's bigger because it in some of her kits she'll just do the the um, glitter headers just as a four so it's kind of like extra um but you have the birthday girls um, and i think those are just kind of fun because um one she included a couple of different skin and hair options um, and then also with that um you know it's like an extra box so if you didn't want to use it you could still um you get the full kit out of it i will definitely be trying to use it um, i'll be using this box probably because it has the brown hair and the light skin which matches me the most um, and then you have your glitter headers and then you have your final page that has the date covers the mini uh, icons that fit in like the checklists then you have a whole bunch of functional deco and a couple of quarter boxes so I cannot wait to use this kit. I love the colors, I love the boxes, and I, I don't know, I just love it. And I have another kit that has this same artwork, but I'm trying to decide, I know I'm gonna be using this one for my main planner, but I'm trying to decide if I wanna use the other one for my uh, memory planner, if I wanna save it, so that's still to be determined, but uh, this one, I just, I love it. So that was everything from 472 in Maine. And if you haven't checked out her shop yet, I just recommend it. I love her her shop. Kate is the sweetest shop owner probably ever. Um, and then, uh, I don't know. I can't say enough good things about her shop. And then last but not least, I have my, I think it was December mystery box from the Paperly Boutique. Honestly, at this point, everyone has probably gotten their box because it came like near the beginning of my vacation but if for some reason you don't want to see it you know you know what to do um but this will be my last thing for this haul so the first little extra you had was this clip from kelly eva designs um and it's just a really nice little um it's almost like a tie-dyed um tie-dyed like cloth clip but i like it because it'll be really easy to throw it throw it in my traveler's notebook and not worry about it getting you know broken or bent or anything because it is you know that nice flexible fabric um so i like that a lot then the featured or the other featured shop or guest shop um was the paper dove shop um and so i have a kit from her as well um then i'm debating whether or not if i want to use that um for the week of my birthday um it's not a birthday theme kit, but okay, regardless, that doesn't make sense for this part. Um, this one is the Paper Dove Shop uh, sampler that she included with this. We've got two full boxes, some glitter headers. I love these little appointment labels. They're pretty skinny. Um, and then you have some checklists, a uh, sidebar sticker, and then some functional deco. Um, and I like it when you have like some extra boxes included um, because uh, the Paperly Boutique kits are very... Full anyways I get the full the full uh, kit subscription and so she usually includes like 10 boxes and then you have another two so then this will be really nice to pull in for an extra spread either traveler's notebook or um, honestly I can probably get like all three of my planners um, planned with these uh, you know couple of sheets um, so very very nice then we have Alex's kit. This one is her freebie. It's her newer format um, that she has had for about like a month or so. And this one has a full box, some half boxes, appointment labels, and then a new releases. Then we have these gorgeous full boxes. I think they're just stunning. And it, this is like a really great kit because since it has the marble, um, you could really use it anytime you could use it right now you could have used it for christmas you could have used it you know for january february i think mine will be like a january february use out of it um just because i think this kind of reminds me of winter just because it reminds me of 
like evergreen, evergreen, like, um, are they leaves? Um, sticks, needles. Um, and so I think that'd be really nice. Then we have her um, ombre checklists, headers and little things. Then we have her bottom washi, washi strip, or like uh, skinny washi strips, and then her um, bigger washi strips. Then we have these like, these ones are almost like a third box. Um, same with these ones are like chunkier appointment labels, um, quarter appointment labels, and then some half boxes. Then we have this one that says you are enough um, as like another extra box. Um, some sidebar stickers, checklists, uh, checklist flags, weekend banner. I love these little arrows and um, bill do some sidebar headers. Then we have this functional sheet that has just a whole bunch of functional deco. Um, I haven't planned with her new kit format yet, so I cannot wait to do that. It's just going to be a couple more weeks because I, since I have like the next couple weeks planned out, um, but once I get to, to back to like no holidays, no events, no birthdays, anything like that, then I'll, I can't wait to use one of her kits again, um, in the new format. Um, and then just a couple of other items. Then she gives you two sets of date covers. Um, another thing that'll really help with split, splitting the kit into a couple of different spreads. Um, and then just a couple more boxes. And then she gives you the glitter sampler as well. Um, so half boxes, quarter boxes, appointment labels, and then glitter headers. So really, really gorgeous kit. Um, this is from the Paperly Boutique and um, Alex's shop is another one of my like all time favorite, can't get enough of shops. Um, so that was everything for this haul. I thank you guys so much for watching and I will just see you in the next one. Bye now.